Hey, it's Dr. Decubulus here. What I wanted to talk about today is something that I find most people don't know and how it affects the body when we're talking about muscles. If they don't heal properly and they're not moving the right way, we get scar tissue that develops in muscles. Now that's a problem. Just think about whenever you have a major cut on the outside of your skin. Let's say you get a big cut here, you end up getting a scar. That area where you have a scar is weaker, it's more sensitive, and it's not going to be at the same level as the skin around it or the skin there was before. The same same thing happens on your muscles inside your body. So when we have a scar that forms on those muscles or scar tissue that forms in those muscle fibers, the muscle is now weaker, it's not as flexible, it's more prone to have pain sensation and a future injury. So that's important to understand because if we know that, we can work to get that scar tissue to stop forming, break down, and turn into normal muscle, we get much better outcome measures. That's why it's so important to know this to start because otherwise it just keeps building up. That's why you keep getting knots that are in the muscle you keep getting these adhesions and the trigger points. That's all scar tissue that's developing in the muscle. And it tells me that something is working abnormally. And because it's working abnormally, that's why we're having this develop. So I hope that answers the question. And I hope that makes a little bit more sense as to why these things keep building up. It's scar tissue in the muscle and that creates permanency.